Central Processing Units or CPUs have long been the primary competition engine for everyday computers and smart devices. Higher the processing power, the faster the computer usually is. We have known software engineers asking for powerful CPUs to run complex programs without lag and delay. Now, organizations have begun using graphics processing units or GPUs in a broad range of applications like gaming, content creation, machine learning, and more. They are designed to accelerate computer graphics workloads. Until two decades ago, GPUs were unheard of. It's the boom in the video games market that led to the development of GPUs. Developers realized the need for a dedicated processor, like a cousin of CPUs, solely for the processing of 2D and 3D graphics of video games. NVIDIA is credited with introducing the first ever GPU to the market in 1999. It was called GeForce 256. With the turn of the century, GPUs gained importance with the development of expansive PC games and higher resolution content in HD and 4K. It is now critical for content creation such as video editing, graphic designing, game design, and even in the field of engineering and architecture. NVIDIA is the leader and the most dominant GPU designer. It pioneered consumer-facing GPUs and now expanding into GPUs for data centers, AI, and machine learning. In the past few years, PC and laptop sales have fallen. In 2022, PC shipments fell by 16%. Gartner reported a 28.5% year-on-year drop in PC sales in the last quarter of 2022. Yet, NVIDIA went on to achieve a massive trillion-dollar market cap. Last year, its CEO said that NVIDIA has $11 billion worth of orders lined up just for the automotive industry. The orders are for GPU for high-tech driving systems. In February this year, the company reported revenue of $27 billion. Clearly, the chip maker is not only diversifying into several areas, but is also strong on finances. Supply chains across the globe were disrupted because of worldwide restrictions during COVID-19 pandemic. Among the causes of shortage was an apparent hoarding of high-quality GPUs by cryptocurrency miners. According to a New York University report, 19% of the world's GPU production in 2020 was used for mining Ether, a cryptocurrency. To counter this, NVIDIA had come out with tailor-made crypto mining processors. However, that wasn't enough to mitigate the global GPU chip shortage. NVIDIA is making aggressive expansion in the GPU space. It recently announced new system architecture for GPUs built in collaboration with Quantum Machines, a company leading quantum computing research. It is capable of extremely low-latency quantum classical computing that can be used for giant AI programs. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn. He's about to land his dream job. Business Standard